Streamer here, and today we are back with some more Undertale. Um, I am actually quite impressed uh, with how much I'm enjoying this game. I will be perfectly honest, I went into this whole thing um, not thinking that I was going to like it, because I, you know, didn't understand what all the hype was, and I didn't, you know, I, I had watched, like, snippets of different playthroughs, not really knowing what was going on, and it didn't look like something that would appeal to me, but now it's kind of becoming a game where I kind of want to play it every day so that I can get further in the story and find out more things. That being said, let's go ahead and get into the game. All right, so when we last left off, um, we had been going through some puzzles that Papyrus and Sans had set up for us. Uh, Papyrus is um, being slightly more prepared than Sans's were. Um, but, uh... Doggo trying to make a snow doggo. Not not going very well. Just staring at it. And uh, that's that's about it. So I really want to go see, see... I don't remember if we checked this out last time. On the floor inside the, is a box of... Pomeraisins? Pom Aware of dog, please pet... Please, please pet dog. Can we pet the dog? This dog is staring blankly into the snow, waiting for it to turn into art. Okay, good luck with that dog. And then we haven't talked to you. You're a very interesting looking cow figure. Very interesting. Okay, let's talk. That dog considers itself an artist, but doesn't even know how, doesn't ever know what to create. It probably doesn't help that its brain is the size of a piece of kibble. Poor dog. To be fair, though, most artists, at least the ones I know, um, don't always know what to create. I mean, one of the fun things about being an artist is you just kind of start making something, and if it turns into something, it does. If it doesn't, it doesn't. Oh, this is going to be hell. Okay. Let's see, what's down here first? Oh, dear lord. Oh, papyrus. It's a snow papyrus! Oh, of course it is. And sands. It's a lump of snow with the word sands written on, in, on it in red marker. Poor sands. Put more effort into your work. <laughs> Alrighty, let's... Oh, I don't even know how I want to begin this. Um, let's try this. See how it goes. Mm. Well, that went better than I thought it would. Perfect. First try! Woohoo! Alrighty. Okay, what? Okay. I don't know how I feel about this. I can't see my character. There was. Wait, what was on our head? Was it just snow? It's this way. Sands is that way. What's this? This is. It's a snow poof. And this is a snow poof. This, however, is a snow poof. Surprisingly, it's a snow poof. <laughs> snow poof. Is it really a snow poof? Behold, a snow poof. Eh? There's 30 gil there's 30 gold inside this. What is this? It's a snow poof. <laughs> there's a doggo! You're so cute looking. Yip yip. Yip yip doggo. Oh, never mind. It's a greater dog. Oh dear. Oh, um. So while we do this, uh, greater dog is too far away to pet. Just pet. You just pet the air. Oh dear. Ow. Ah, no, no, no. no. Um, so I started watching Markiplier's playthrough of this because I've been wanting to watch it for quite a while, actually. But I wanted to play the game, so I've been avoiding it. But I watched up to the point where 
I, uh, to the point where, um, I'm at in the story for my playthrough, and I've missed so many things and forgotten about so many things that I knew and I knew I should have remembered, like the fact that there's multiple endings and the endings depend on how you treat everybody, and I am killing people, which means I'm not going to get the pacifist ending, which means crap. But we're gonna try and make up for that, and so we'll probably get the middle of the road ending. Um, but let's see. It bounds towards you, flicking slobber into your face. Now can we pet? Greater dog is seeking affection. Pet pet. Greater dog curls up in your lap as it is pet by you. It gets a com it gets a so comfortable it falls asleep. Zzz. So basically, one of the biggest things that I'm upset about that I learned from watching Mark's playthrough is you didn't have to kill Toriel. Which y'all are probably like, well, duh, and I'm an idiot because I didn't realize that that was a thing. And I feel terrible because now I wish I hadn't killed her. But, um, yeah. Oops. Then it wakes up. It's so excited. Oh, nope. I forgot. White we have to move, blue we don't. Um, greater dog is patting the ground with its front paw. Play. You make a snowball and throw it for the dog to fetch. It splits on it splits on the ground. Greater dog picks up all the snow in the area and brings it to you. Now now dog is very tired. You rest it rests it rests its head on you. Now I knew I should have moved. Greater Dog wants some TLC. Pet. As you pet the dog, it sinks its entire weight on into you. Your movements slow, but you still haven't you still haven't pet enough. Don't bark at me. No, don't bark at me. Pet capacity is 40%. Oh dear. More petting. You pet dis. dis <clears throat> you pet dis. dis deceivingly? You. Pet capacity reaches 100%. The dog flops over with its legs hanging in the air. Who is barking? Ow! Greater dog is contented. Okay, so we can. show mercy and spare. You won! You earn 0 XP and 40 gold. Good puppy. Oh, you're so cute. Oh, look at his face. Look at our face. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. What's this way? What is this way? There's a bridge. I have a feeling the bridge is going like, to break or something. That's the feeling I'm getting. Oh, God. Okay, so we could have gone either way, I guess. Oh, now I want to know what the other way was. Human! This is your final and most dangerous challenge. Behold the garg Behold the gauntlet of deadly terror. Oh dear. When I say the word, it will fo fully activate. Cannons will fire, spikes will swing, blades will slice. Each part will swing violently up and down. Only the tiniest chance of victory will remain. Are you ready? Because I am about to do it. There's a dog. There's a dog. <laughs> Why is one of them one of the doggos? <laughs> well, what's the hold up? Hold up? What hold up? I'm I'm about to activate it now. That uh doesn't look very activated. Well, this challenge, it seems maybe too easy to defeat the, hu the human with. Yeah, we can't use this one. I am a skeleton with standards. My puzzles are very far. Fair, fair, not far. And my traps are especially cooked. Especially cooked. But this method is too direct, too cr too, yeah, this method is too direct. No class at all. Anyway, it, uh, away it goes. Oh, 
Okay. Phew. What are you looking at? This was another de this was another deceive de deceive victory for Papyrus. Yeah. Heh. Heh. Oh, they did. Can I go back the other way? I want to see what the other way was. There was a flowey there. I saw it. Did you see it? I saw it. There was a flowey. I saw it. There was a flowey. I saw it. I know it was there. I kind of want to go back. I go back this way. And then, damn it. I didn't want for that to happen. Ice Cap and Snowdrake confront you, sighing Jerry. Act. Um, no. We got two. I really didn't want to one hit you, but okay. Why are you doing this? Shoot. Kind of lucked out on that one. Um, act. Snow Drake. Um, joke. You made a bad ice pun. The other monsters think it's hilarious. I don't do. Uh, I don't do it that way. I, don't, I think that's what that said. No. Staying at the bottom is not the best idea. I'm gonna die. Snow Drake is puffed up. Um, nice cream. Love yourself. I love you. You've received 50 HP. Do I really? Ow. Ugh. That's Snowdrake. Joke. You make a bad ice pun. The other monsters think it's hilarious. That's not like me. Come on. I need... Snow Drake to make a joke so we can laugh so that it not wants to kill us. We can show mercy to. Come on. Make a bad ice spawn. The other monsters think it's hilarious. That's not like. Okay, so I have to. Maybe if I laugh first. Ow. Nope, nope. Um. Laugh. You laugh at Snow Drake's pun. See? Laughs! Dad, I was wrong. Maybe he made a pun and I just didn't notice. I died. That was fast. I think that's the fastest I've died so far. I gotta be back when I get back to this point. Or, well, I'm gonna go see what was down below instead of going across the bridge this time. I'll be right back when we get to that point. Alright guys, we're back to uh, where we were before we passed the circle puzzle and last time we went this way and we checked out all the snow cliffs and went to the bridge and we saw Sans and Papyrus, but this time we're going to go down this way, so I want to see what Sans has to say down here. What's up? Oh god, there's eyes in that wall. Is that all you have to say? What's up? There's a lot of eyes in that wall. Hi Sans. Are you lost? Ugh. Oh gosh, you're a, you're a, you're an interesting looking thing, aren't you? Um, there's a dog, and one of his antlers. There's candy cane on one of the antlers. I'm not entirely sure what the box thing is on his back. Um, no, I don't want to fight. Act. Um. Gift. Aw, he refused my gift. How do you know... It's, how do I know it's not a trick? Oh gosh. No. Skyfrock? Skyfrock? Tries vainly, vainly to remove its decorations. Undecorate. You remove the box from non-dog related ra raisins. Of non-dog related raisins. That's a little better. Oh gosh. Nope, I got hit. Slightly less irritated. Undecorate. You remove a small, confused dog. That's a little better. Now what? No, I don't get to move. No, I just went right into that one. Alright. Just one more time. It might work. You remove the striped cane that says, I use this tiny cane to walk on. On it. 
The weight has been lifted. Gano's problems have been taken away. I bet you we can mercy him now. Spare! You won. You earned zero XP and 20 gold. Coolio, holio. There's a cave. I feel like this is not going to end well. What's that? What have we found? What have we discovered? What's this? It's a door. Clearly. Can we go in the door? No? Oh, I wonder if it's gonna be some kind of like pattern. Now can I go in the door? No. No? Did I miss some kind of hint? Alright, I'll be right back. I'm gonna see if I can figure this out. Alright guys, I'm not entirely sure what the combination is. Um, although I do remember, I did just remember something else I forgot to do. Um, I discovered because of Markiplier's playthrough is we can use this and we can equip the tough glove because it is armor. And then I think we can use the toy. We have equipped the toy knife. So there's that too. Um, but yeah, I'm not entirely sure what was going on there. Say, are you following me? No. Why would I do that? You sure do like to exercise. Alright, I'll be back once we get through everything and I don't think we checked this out. Oh, tiny dog house. Alright, I'll be back once we get back to everything that we hadn't seen before. Alright guys, we're back to, uh, just after talking to Papyrus and Sans at the bridge, so hopefully we can get across here without running into anything. Talk to Sans. I don't know what my brother's going to do now. If I were you, I would make sure I understand blue attacks. Yeah, I know. I'm gonna keep forgetting that, though. Hey, bro. Hello, uh, I don't think we can click on it, though. Welcome to Snowden. Welcome to Snowden Town. Is that a shop? I didn't mean to go in there yet. We are actually going to check these out next time because we have a little sparkle here, which means it is the end of the episode. The sight of such a friendly town fills you with determination. See ya. Alright guys, don't forget to like if you enjoyed the video, subscribe for more, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye!